In this segment, we're going to demonstrate a muscle energy technique to treat a thoracic dysfunction, T8, that is type 1, neutral, side bent right, and rotated left. So to find the spinous process and transverse process of T8, we would find the inferior angles of the scapula. We'd come to the midline, and that's the level of the spinous process of T7, and just lateral to that is the transverse process of T8. So I can put my fingers on the transverse process of T8, and I can drop down with my ring finger to the spinous process of T8 and interspace of T9. Then I can have my patient put their left arm on their head, and then their opposite arm on their elbow, and I'm going to come underneath and put my hand on the patient's biceps and let that patient fall asleep on my forearm. And we must now monitor the inner space between T8 and T9 and find neutral. There we go, nice balanced point. Then, because the segment is rotated to the left and side bent to the right, I can just very gently pull my hand toward me and raise my arm on her under her shoulder to translate and side bend to the side bending left barrier and then I can slowly rotate her right to the rotation right barrier. And then we're going to have our patient perform an isometric contraction in side bending to the right. So we're going to have a patient drive her right shoulder down into me for a count of one, two, three, and relax. During the relaxation phase, I'm going to maintain neutral and add a little bit more side bending to the new side bending left barrier and add a little bit more rotation to the new rotation right barrier. And again, we could add a isometric contraction in side bending down to the right. So she pushes down with her right shoulder. One, two, three, and relax. Fall asleep. Again, during the re relaxation phase, side bending left barrier, rotation right barrier. Again, patient's going to, and I can give her a little tap for her to aim for that direction. Pushing down, pushing down, pushing down with her shoulder. Relax. And then again, translate and side bend to the side bending left barrier and the rotation right barrier. I could also introduce a rotational isometric contraction. So I find my barriers and I can give her a little tap on her left shoulder and have her try to turn her shoulder to the left for a count of three and I should feel a muscle contraction under my finger. And then when she relaxes after a contraction for three to five seconds, I reposition her to her new rotation right barrier and also translate to her new side bending left barrier. Usually requires three to five contractions with each contraction being held for three to five seconds. The patient's force of contraction should be enough to feel muscle twitch with my finger that is palpating the segment. And after three to five contractions, you're always going to reposition after each contraction to the feather edge of the new barriers. And then after the technique, we're going to reassess the segmental motion to determine the effectiveness of the technique. So a muscle energy technique to treat a T8 type 1 neutral side bent right rotation left dysfunction.